Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Tats, and today I'd like to talk to you about a game that is near and dear to my heart, but I haven't really played it or streamed it in quite a while, and that is Deep Rock Galactic. You see, back when I first got a PC and into streaming and PC gaming in general, my PC wasn't by anywhere near top of the line. In fact, it was on the lower end. And one of the games that I could play and stream at the same time was Deep Rock Galactic. I had a group of friends I played with. We were called the Dirty Dog Crew or something like that. But I had a blast playing and streaming it, and I actually played it a lot offline too. However, I kind of fell off with it. You know, I don't know, I just got burnt out on it. And then, like, the modding community really started taking off, and I got into, like, the Twitch spawns and everything. But then I fell back off. So it's been, like, a back and forth with Deep Rock Galactic. Um, more recently, they started doing season passes, which I thought was great. And the one good thing I've always liked about Deep Rock is that they do constant updates, and the updates are free. Really, the only thing they charge you for is, like, DLC. However, there are these side projects they do, and so one day I boot up Steam and I, I saw this. I saw that they were doing these vinyl pre-orders. Now, I don't own any vinyls. In fact, this is going to be the first set of vinyls that I will ever own. I just, I love Ghost Ship games, um, I love Deep Rock Galactic, and then when I saw this, and I just saw how cool that these vinyls looked, I was like, I have to have these. So... I pre-ordered these, and I cannot wait to get them. I will make a video unboxing it when um, they come in. Um, orders close on November 1st, so there is still time to get these. Um, there are two different editions. Uh, there's the ones that you see right here. Uh, I ordered these ones um, because I was like, if I'm doing this, typically when I order something for video games or just in general, I will always go top of the line, um, you know, whatever the special edition I can get is. Um, you know, there's going to be 21 different tracks, which I think is pretty cool. I mean, like... I mean, this is just awesome. This is what you see a lot of video game companies not do, and I think this is actually really smart. Um, here's the standard one if you do want to get it. I mean, nothing wrong with it, but just that looks so sweet. But if you do get the variant edition, you get these coasters, which are based on the beers in the game, which I think is so cool. So, you know, when I saw this, I was like, all right, I need to make an effort to get back into this game that I love. I want to make more content on it. So, with that being said... With Season 3 coming out soon, I want to do a reaction to that. So that's what we're going to do right now. We're just going to take a look at it. And I'm just going to break it down, give my general thoughts and opinions on it. Um, I think it looks really great. I have already watched this prior to doing this video. Um, I see this video and it gives me like a lot of uh, Gears of War 2 vibes. With like how the Lambit first come in. It looks like the bugs of Hoxus are going to be infected. And like, for example, right here. Um, it just looks so cool. I mean, like... I mean, they're, it's very, very hush-hush. Right now, the new season drops on November 3rd, and I, I'm really excited for it. Like, this? This looks cool. Like, I can't wait to see what this is. Is this some kind of, like, hive mind mentality? Like, let's let's roll this back just real quick. Like, what is this? This just, this. Again, again, I referenced Gears of War 2 and the Lambit. Um, you see the bugs are kind of, like, infected. They got, like, those polyps on them, almost like what an exploder has. Um, but this just has me excited. Can like you just imagine if like some kind of infection is spreading on Hoxus? Again, I'm speculating, but um, I, it just this alone got me super excited. Um, the rival tech season they did for one and two was good. I I started this season's first season pass, but I I fell off it again. I it, nothing against the game. Like I just I fell off it. There was other things going on. I did a couple challenge runs on my Twitch channel, but this has me genuinely excited, um, and I can't wait. So. It's it's called Plague Fall and it's coming um Yeah, it's coming later later I think they said November third. Um but this has me genuinely excited. Um there's new DLC coming out for skins that look pretty cool, weapon skin pack. I'm gonna get that. Um so this is my effort to start making more deep rock galactic content because I wanna support uh, Ghost Ship Games, I want to support the community again, I want to just get back into it. Um, so starting off with not only this video, but I'm going to start recording the weekly deep dives. Um, probably the elite ones, maybe the regular ones, but either way, there's going to be some kind of form of weekly Deep Rock Galactic content that I will try to put out on my YouTube. You won't see too much on my Twitch channel unless I have need of some filler or anything. But um, yeah, let me know your thoughts down below of what you're thinking about this latest season. Is this a, are, are they still going in the right direction? I want to hear from my viewers out there or anyone out in the community in general. I'm pretty excited for this one. This one, this one has me genuinely excited. And I think this is really going to help me dive back into the game. Um, if you want to see more of this content, throw a like to the video. Comment down below what you think of this new season teaser. And then if you really want to see the vinyl unboxing, be sure to definitely throw a comment down below and turn on the bell for notifications. Um, I got a lot of cool things I'm going to be unboxing later this year for Collector's Editions. And you can always catch me live on Twitch at iGotsTats. Thanks for watching.